So in our exhibitry, and we were the first out of the box to do this 17 years ago, and when we opened the new Rose Center for Earth and Space here in New York, the, the we took Pluto away, grouped it with other icy bodies that had been discovered in the outer solar system. Pluto and they look more alike than either one of them looks like any of the other planets. The New York Times caught wind of this. Page one, below the fold, but page one story. Pluto not a planet? Only in New York. And that's when the hate mail started coming from third graders. Dear Dr. Ted, why'd you take away my favorite, my favorite planet? That's where it started. And they, who were in third grade in the year 2000, <coughs> have now graduated college, I think. Did I do the math right? Yeah. Third grade, eight. They're, they're adults now. Mm -hmm. And they're still pissed off. <laughs> so. Well, I have one bone to pick with you. It's the Manhattan Henge. Mm -hmm. Because you popularized the Manhattan Henge. Yeah. And now, every time the Manhattan Henge is a thing, there's a bunch of amateur photographers on 34th Street just out there with their Completely phones. Completely blocking traffic. Completely.